the madman. Build the master versus wolf. Go. Sure. Versus a mangy wolf. Look what the dogs dug up. Wow, that's a winner. Oh, please. The hunt is on, Shaw. Use your dogs to get the jump on foes. Second. Not even charge, lol. This deck seems pretty bad. Uh oh. Your bloodhounds have plus two attack. Hmm. Okay. After you play a minion trigger, it's death rattle effect. Zero of those. Yep. And what do we got here? Mark of Yashiraj, Windwalker, and Call of the Well. That's pretty bad. Uh, good. These are pretty good. These aren't bad. I'll take these cards that seem like ahead of the curve. Oh, you're a power deal three. That's pretty good. I guess I'll just use it all the time. Why is this even in the deck? Woof woof. This is a very tame game. That's a random card for a raven caller to have in their deck. Novice engineer. Ran out of uh, chicken themed cards, huh? I don't wish experimenter is cute. Why dead? Trigger a friendly minion's death rattle. There's still zero of those in the deck. Add Sylvanas. 
Let's see, these, meh, these, eh. Avanus is a very good card. But is it worth putting in two useless cards? So, Tracking Tracker Arphis. Eh. I don't have any big minions to discover. Or Sylvanas, just the trigger of play then. I guess we'll wait for that exact combo. Stay a while and listen. Stay forever. Gain control of enemy minions with one or less attack. Eh, because of the uh because Russell of Bard was too OP. Sazmi! At last, an audience! Well, you're no Russell, but Okay, uh, this is starting to feel good. I'm like a paladin now. Oh, the combo! Wow. <laughs> I like pushing the button, making the guys. It's okay if the guys are wolves, dogs. That's actually better. Good doggo. Push button each turn. Success. Feel success. I think taunt is best. No, plus one plus one is best because that's like taunt. In this case. Okay, you might actually be stronger than Russell. <laughs> oh my god. This isn't that good since they'll just take control of the, uh, the guy. I guess that's fine if they do. Doggo. Excellent. Unleash the haunts. Wait, what? Wait, gain control of enemy minions? Minions? <laughs> what? Minions? That's bad. All right, it's time for a scam. Take a walk on the wild side. Can't we all just get along? That's pretty OP, also. Oh, if only I still had Doggo. That was all bad. You're being awfully forward. You're too much for me.
Bards are overpowered. I used to play a bard in Ultima Online. Yeah, uh, well, let's see. We have your blood hands at plus two attack again. At the end of your turn, restore two health to all friendly characters. Oh, companionship seems okay. Press the button. Stomp, stomp, stomp. I have one minion that has five or more attack. Okay. Exotic beasts. That's really interesting of a package. Terrible, but interesting. What in the world? Rush, lifesteal, death rattle? Well, I have the rush, I have the lifesteal, and I have the death rattle. Okay. The Gilnean people will love me once Athara sways them. Whenever a player draws a card, deal one damage to them. Sathara! Put down your weapons. Join us. Alright, uh, well, press button, hope to win game. Oh! For themselves, too. Well, good thing we have the powerful Swamp Leech. Exotic Beasts again. This time we have the Wasp, which is pretty bad. On the hunt. These cards are kind of quality. And then Sludge Sludge Hadronox. Interesting. So I either get two Sludge Belcher, but I get a Hadronox, or I get Flanking Strike, but I get an Arphus and a Tracker. I think the Arphus and the Tracker are less bad than the Hadronox. Eh, it's really close. Yee. Like, do I really want to keep the leech? After all, they have the shank. I guess. Give your minions plus one plus one in lifesteal. Wait, that's not permanent. We have Butch and Baba. Plus one plus one for each friendly beast that died this game. I'm going to be pressing the button a lot. Baba, summon six one one bloodhounds to attack an enemy minion. Wait, that's just... Oh, and my bloodhounds have plus two attack. That's like Dr. Baba. Let's see, death rattle synergy, not really anything. 
Splittering Fester Root. Divide and Conquer. Oh, oh, I get it. And Double Flanking Strike. Ooh. We've got like packages of just generally good cards here. So, what's best? Eh, take more um, proactive cards. Winslow Tub Talk. Each player shuffles their hand into their deck and draws that many cards. Weird. Winslow Tub Talk. Oh, a volunteer. Bubba Bubba. Nah. Eh, this is a really good card if I get to seven, but I can always press the button until seven. You usually don't toss treasures back in your deck. That was a pretty big late, you know, pretty late game treasure. And the deck is kind of small. Alright, Bubba wants in. Alright, and Hypnotize will shuffle into my deck anyways. Bubba Bubba. So this guy's hero power is basically worthless. To what I understand, at least. Oh, the synergy. I see. Welcome to my web. Oh, a symmetric effect break. Feels a little bit bad that my best play is just two mana, seven three one. No oh, OP. the cool symmetric effects of Hypnotize. Okay. Now I respect you, Tub Tuck. Uh oh. Oh my god, we just got Tub Tuck. Rude is even worse than I thought it was. I mean, I I know it. I knew it was bad, but it's like I can't think of a situation where I'd want to play him. All right, four, one, one, two. Play the six and the two. Sure. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Clear, clear. Use this with my hero power ever, so I guess we'll play.
<laughs> of course. Um, let's see. So, I guess we'll go here power. Uh, that's a card of some sort. It's a very cute hypnotist flavored duck. So cute. Okay, a lot of skill in that right pack. 5 mana 7-7. Seven, seven. Copy Beast. Copy Bubba. Copy High Main. 3 mana deal 5 is pretty good. I guess we'll just take that. I think I will keep Bubba now. Bubba pretty good. Bubba Bubba. Game plan is simple, hero power until Bubba. Seven seven strong enough to take out with deadly shot. Oh, I guess. Love is only good when I'm losing, probably. Something like that. So much cheating, Splinter Graft. Won't you eventually die to the might of my... I just can't resist pushing the button each turn. Faster
Alright, your minions that cost 5 or more cost 5, so that buffs 5 of the cards in my deck by a little bit. Caltrops after your opponent plays a minion deal 1 damage, or double starting health. Is Caltrops OP or P, or should I just take Potion of Vitality? This has been playing as a control deck, so... Double the potion. Yeah, And just keep pushing the button. Something like that. Now we got Doggo, Arphis, Houndmaster, we have... Solid 5 drop, I have no 5s. 8 drop. Uh, bleh. Primordial Drake. Solid pack. Gastropods and a Drake. None of these are bad, but none of them are amazing. I think the snails are really good against AI. And the 5 drop is pretty good, I suppose. Snails are gonna be really good against the, uh, big guys. I don't know how many people would have picked snail package there. Let's see, arena experience talking. Well, at least Bubba is gonna be pretty good in this one. Sick those big minions. It's a pretty spooky opening. Lots of mana. We have deadly shot. And we have some doggos. I don't remember any AoE removal, so we'll just let the Anaconda do its thing. Go face, how would I get punished? I don't know. Possible if he has some sort of uh, AoE type. Alright, let's try this. Praise Snail. Praise Bubba? Praise Bubba. Do I play Bubba here? I'll just play Bubba. Bubba Bubba. Dr. Bubba in the house. Ba -dum -bum, ba -dum -bum -bum -bum, ba -dum -bum, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24. Could just go face. Seems reasonable to me.
<laughs> that tickle. The hyena is pretty much always going to be a 2 mana 4 3 that I'll play on turn 4. That's not bad. Flesh Eating Ghoul will pretty much always be a 3 3 with the potential of upside. And Defender of Argus is a decent card. Let's see, these cards. Uh, poison is pretty good against PV. And the cards are meh. I'm going to go with Team Poison. Oh, Scarecrow. Destroy a friendly minion, restore 8 health to your hero. Oh, friendly minion. Okay. Easy. The scarecrow. The reaping will commence. Baba, how bad could a boss that kills their own minions be? When you kill a minion with this weapon, gain plus one attack. Job's done. Hmm. <laughs> Trying to see how this all synergizes together. I'll figure it out. Give me a moment. Come close and listen. Mech duck. Okay, kind of makes sense. Scarecrow. Probably should be pretty much always rushing my minions. Is okay. Giant Wasp Belly. So do I even play my hero power because that'll just make Scythe go up? But probably not. I think I just play Wasp Pass. What is the point of this hero power? This in Houndmaster, I would have a 5-3. Kill that, that's a 5-1. I'm gonna go with this one. I basically have to pretend they're Jaina. Cross such Jaina. Yeah, that's a good way of thinking of it. Making sure that weapon doesn't get out of control. Safety restrictions offline. Yeah, that's the bubble target. It's time to stop being afraid of Scythe. Comes the scythe. This be 
beast will not be tamed. Wow, he actually got harvest with Red Seed. OP, OP. And it's kind of interesting. This doesn't seem to synergize with. Well, I guess it does because you need to fuel your own. And it's kind of interesting. Alright. Calling in the Bubba. Bubba has no time to play fetch. Okay, final boss. Oh, a scythe! When you kill a minion with this weapon, gain plus one attack. And I have the plus vote potion of vitality. Interesting. That's the old militia horn. Give your minions plus one, plus one, and taunt. Upgrade this and shuffle it into your deck. Or a spyglass. Put a copy of a random card in your opponent's hand into yours. It costs three less. Okay, well, scythe seemed pretty good. It's scythe to meet the final boss. I have no weapons in my deck, so... It seemed good to have this one. Let's see, so we've got generally efficient minions. We have Green Jelly Lull. And we have Scavenging Hyena, which is great. Vermin Sensei, which is pretty good. Hold the Well, I haven't cast it a single time yet, because I don't have one, somehow. Scavenging Hyena is really good. Vermin Sensei, combos with the beast I can make all the time. I guess we'll take companions. Linda! While you control a minion, your hero is immune. Yeah, that isn't even a good hero power. Easy. I've tracked you down at last, Crowskin. Have you tracked us? Or have we lured you here? How bad could it be? Just gotta kill all the minions. Ooh, got Scythe. OP. Very nice. Why? Why did you cast your lock with Hagger? Lor. If you knew her power, sure, you'd heal like your dogs. Scythe to meet you, Glinda.
Oh. My grateful followers. The crow. I can either we I can either end up with nothing or I can have a 3-3 three, three on the board. I care more about tempo or more about value? No, well, let's go value. I have 90 health. Press this button. One game. I will not forget you. Whatever your name was. Hot dog. Join our company. Oh, time to cut some people down with the scythe. Happy to throw down in a value game against anybody. Hyena Bubba combo. <laughs> Only four doggos, but. Six, not bad. Oh, cheat. Oh no, my giant minions. They have to go into these puny guys. The brilliance of Glinda Crowskin's deck building is now apparent. Fiend just circle OP. Let's see, we could play five hunting mastiffs. I'm clear, but putting this guy out is a better tempo. Who cares about boss health? It's all about board position. Weapon is getting up there. Oh, also, there's no like super OP things I don't know about here. Clearly, just some sort of uh, attrition game. Thanks to Scythe, I've got the attrition on my side. Good health is hard to mind control. 
I think we don't want the two twos to break, so how about we just leave the yeah, we'll leave that one up, so it hit. Uh, deal with this one somehow, probably with this and that. Yeah, it seems fine. And then I guess just don't play anything. Or oh. value game. Yeah, might as well use this to kill this. Alright, the walls are almost down! Another one joins the fold. Embrace the crow. Alright, so this card can never get better because of the hero power. So I guess we'll just cast it now. I mean, I can never cast this with the hero power, so... The shields! The shields are down! This is really good while I have Leoc out, so... Maybe I'll just flanking strike a 1-1. One, one. 4 6 10. Yeah, sure. 4-1 is pretty good. Take it nice and slow at my own pace. I don't think I want to take six damage. Right. Would I rather have? It would be better to actually have these scout than have dealt the damage one time. Yeah, let me just punch that. Go for no AOE. He's played a lot of it. Yeah. Apparently there is all the AoE in there. Turns out Scythe is pretty good. Yuck, yuck, yuck. 